Okay, we'll get started with Phillies manager Rob Thompson. We'll start with Corey right here. Rob, it had been a pretty long time since Alvarado had a wild out. Mm -hmm. like that. Was there anything he said or in particular you saw as to what happened? You know, I thought, you know, Strom was off four days. Soto was off six. Alvy was off three or four. So I, I thought that a couple of those guys were, were rusty, but not Alvarado. I, I thought his stuff was really good. I thought he was just missing. Um, but, you know, you have games like that. And uh, you know, I still trust him a great deal. Stuff's great. And what made Soto the guy over Strom in that sixth inning? Well, because I wanted Strom for a full inning, really. And Soto's had really good numbers against uh, uh, Nimmo and Martinez. It didn't work out today. Like I said, I think he was a little bit rusty. Was there consideration given to letting Taiwan keep going there? And, you know, what did you, I mean, he obviously did pretty well today. What did he you did. I, I thought Taiwan's stuff was really good. And he threw strikes. He got ahead. Uh, I thought in that last inning, he started getting the ball up a little bit. Um, you know, he walked Alonzo on four pitches. Uh, and I just thought it was time to go. And I, I wanted to get him out of there. I wanted to end his day without giving up any runs. That's what I wanted to do. I wanted him to have a good day, feel good about it, because he pitched great. I learned that the, the pass ball on, on JT there it looked like, you know, he tried to catch it in a weird way. I, that was not a cross up, it was just cut. Uh, I think the cutter moved just differently than it normally cuts. Yeah. And then uh, the, the bat with Castellanos, uh, Smith was kind of wild there. He comes out hacking. Nick's an aggressive hitter. Would you have liked to have seen him take a pitch there or two? Um, uh, not necessarily. You know, I, I, think, I think the first pitch he swung at was a pitch that he just missed and was a good pitch to hit. So if it's there, go get it. Yeah, Rob, how do you reflect on the two days as a whole? You've spoken about the experience. You guys had a good win yesterday, but obviously coming up short today, and now you've got a long uh, travel back to the States. I thought it was a great experience. I'd do it every year if we could. I mean, the ML, as I said yesterday, MLB has done a great job. I think the people of England uh, in this area have done a great job. They treated us, us with class and uh, yeah, it's been a great experience, and you know, a tough loss today, but it was a great ball game, great ball game for fans to watch. Uh, obviously, you spoke a moment ago about a few misses and, and things like that. Was that just sort of the tone of the day? It felt like that just nothing was quite going your way, despite a lot of the production, like potentially being there on another day. Yeah, I mean, you know, you feel pretty good with three nothing lead, and 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 then. Uh, Dahl comes in and hits the pinch hit home run, and you feel pretty good there because you got Hoffman and Alvarado coming. Um, and it just didn't work out. We had our chances. We had bases loaded, nobody out in the first, and came away with one run. So we had our chances, and, and that happens sometimes. So you just got to, you know, shower up and move on. And obviously now leaving London, like what's the, the mission statement for the team on your way back to Philadelphia? Get some rest, stay healthy. Um, you know, and this team here. They, they can turn the page real easy. And you know, tomorrow's a new day, it's an off day. They're gonna need it. And then we get back after on Tuesday. With the kind of stuff Soto has, why do you think he hasn't been able to find consistent results? And what do you think is like the key for him moving forward? Well, he's been actually pitching pretty well up until today. I mean, he's had some pretty good outings, the last five, six outings. Um, because they, They've really simplified his delivery. Instead of the high leg lift and, and then go to a slide step, it's all slide step and his arm's able to catch up. So, um, you know, I, I chalk this one up to just rust. Thank you. It was a great, great time. Nice job.